Well, I did end up selling this Sea Sprite. A nice couple from down at Oriental bought it. They're downsizing. They had a 40 foot boat or so and uh, just recently sold it. And they were looking for something smaller for primarily for a day sailing on the Noose River. So this would be perfect for that. But anyway, I'm gonna deliver it to them tomorrow. And uh, not have never launched at the ramp I'm gonna be loading, uh, unloading it at. So I'm uh, rigging up a, an extension, a tongue extension. I uh, just got a piece of uh, two inch, two inch tubing, uh, thick wall, quarter inch tubing, two, two inch square. And um, that slides inside of the existing tongue. It's kind of heavy to do with one hand here. Anyway, that slides inside of the existing tongue. Just like that. So that gives me an extra eight feet um, to uh, get it out a little, little bit deeper. So hopefully I won't have a problem. All else fails, we'll get the travel lift to take it off the trailer, but I think this is gonna work. And then I've got a, a grade eight a grade eight bolt put through it to uh, lock it in place. That'll keep it from pulling out. And then it also bumps against this bolt here that's holding the frame together. So that gives uh, about two and a half, uh, almost three feet that it slides back inside the, uh, the existing tongue. So anyway, just a little extension. Um, kind of hate to see it go, but you know, I, I can't keep them all. So let me move this one here on out of the yard and then I'll get started on the next one. I will try to remember to take a little bit of video of launching it. I'm gonna help the guy, you know, set, step, step the mast and you know, get it rigged and, uh, and launch it. Help him get it over to his uh, slip, which is about a mile away from the ramp.
That's good. 